Cloud resources that you aren't using are expensive. It's helpful to detect unused or underutilized resources, but even better to correct those problems. And we can do that with the new Azure Thrifty mod for Flowpipe, just by running commands in the console and configuring some variables. Let's take a look. Here's a query for external IP addresses, some of which might be unattached and not needed. We're in a directory where we've cloned the Azure Thrifty mod. Let's run one of its pipelines. Setting no approvers means the pipeline runs without interruption and notifies but takes no action. Flowpipe found two unattached addresses but didn't do anything. Now we do want to take action, but selectively on a per address basis. Omitting the approvers arg means the approvals will happen using the default notifier, which is the terminal. You can instead pass the approvers arg with notifiers for Slack or email so the interaction would happen in those places. Okay, let's run it. Flowpipe pauses on the first detected address and offers the choice to skip or delete. Let's say we check that one and decide to keep it, so we'll choose skip. Now Flowpipe detects the next one. We'll check that one too, and we decide we don't need it, so we'll choose delete. Here's the final report. We skipped the first one, then deleted the second. It wouldn't make much sense to automatically release unattached IP addresses without checking each one, but you might want to automatically delete compute snapshots older than a threshold number of days. Fortunately, there's another pipeline for that. Compute snapshots exceeding max age is the one we're looking for. We'll activate a query-based trigger to look for old snapshots on a schedule, and we'll set some configuration variables to control how it works. We need approvers to be the empty list to do this automatically without pausing for input. We'll run Flowpipe in server mode, so it runs the query on a scheduled trigger, and we'll point it at that package of variables. We can see that the Compute Snapshot Pipeline is enabled and running on a schedule. We can see the query it's using to find snapshots older than 90 days. On a weekly basis, the trigger will fire, and those older snapshots will be deleted. And that's Azure Thrifty in a nutshell. The pipelines we've seen here are just two of a family of pipelines for various underused or unused Azure resources. And remember, although we've shown approvals happening directly in the terminal, you can route those decisions through other channels like Slack or email. It's a really flexible and powerful mod, and we know people will save lots of money by using it. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to try out Flowpipe for yourself, download it today for free at flowpipe.io. See the description for links and other details.